This is my TBR for Alcott April. Welcome back to Candlewick Library. I'm Cheryl. I had already decided on a readathon I was doing in April that fit perfectly with a bunch of the books that I was really hoping to get to in April. But then Tiffany at Beautiful Minutia, Dia at Novel Idea, Kelly from Kelly Reads a Lot, Anne from In Search of Wonder, and Emma, the bookish princess, announced the Alcott April readathon. And I love Louise May Alcott, so I really wanted to take part. And there's not very many prompts, so I decided there's going to be one book that is for both readathons and the rest I just am going to add extra onto what I'm already planning on reading in April. You can head over to any of their channels to get more information about the reading sprints and things that they have planned for the month. But one thing that I think is going to be really fun is they have a group read, which is The Inheritance from Louisa May Alcott. This is a book that I haven't read by her yet. And then on Friday, April 26th, they're gonna be watching the adaptation of this. As for the prompts, each one of the hosts has a different prompt. Tiffany's prompt is to read a nonfiction book about Louisa May Alcott or the time period in which she lived. I'm gonna be reading The Childhood of Famous Americans, Louisa May Alcott. We have read a few of these books in our homeschool and I've enjoyed them. So I've been looking forward to reading this one. Dia's prompt is to watch an adaptation of a Louisa May Alcott book. And that will be easy because I will be watching The Inheritance. I'm actually going to be putting two of the prompts together, which is something I don't do very often, but this time I'm going to. Kelly's prompt is a work that inspired Louisa May Alcott, and Emma's prompt is something by one of her neighbors. We visited Orchard House in 2009, and also that day went to Walden's Pond. And so I know that Henry David Thoreau didn't, wasn't too far away from them. And I also have read that he, she was inspired by him. So I'm gonna be reading The Illustrated Walden or Life in the Woods by Henry David Thoreau. And then Anne's prompt was, is to read a short story by Louis, Louise May Alcott. So I'm gonna be reading this short story collection, Behind a Mask. From what I've heard, it's short stories that have a darker side. I don't know if I'll be reading the whole book or just one short story from it, but I'm gonna shoot for the whole thing and then just see how much time I have. That's all the prompts, so it wasn't very many to add to what I was already gonna be reading. Little Women and Little Men are two of my favorite books, and so I'm very excited to actually do this. Let me know if you're gonna be taking part in this readathon as well.